relatively high point. Started way, where did I start? Way, way down that way. But, as I've come up to this sort of ridge line here, I saw that guy right there. So that's what I'm gonna have to do. <laughs> if you start climbing, you gotta go to the highest point if possible. I mean, that's just uh, a requirement as far as I'm concerned. So I'm gonna be heading up that way. It looks like it gets pretty steep, but we'll see as, uh, as I give it a shot. It's nice, it's a little bit breezier up here, so it's not as um, hot, 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 hot. Such a cool place, so barren, so wild. made it to the top it's pretty freaking spectacular last year I actually flew the drone over these pretty impressive formations down in this valley here and uh, I didn't really get anything good the light wasn't great but it's it's amazing I've had to kind of come down here in this little saddle just because it's blowing about 40 mile an hour right now maybe gusts up to 50 so it's it's pretty windy uh, but right here, it's it's actually like not bad at all. So yeah, that was worth it. That was worthwhile. It got a little steep towards the end, but it wasn't anything too bad. <sighs> I'm gonna get some water. I'm thirsty. Well, I made it back to the car, and uh, it is very, very warm, very hot, which is why I have the door open right now, because I can't have the air conditioning on, because then you won't be able to hear me, so I need some sort of airflow, and it's not really doing much, but <laughs> anyway, on the way back down, I was kind of thinking up some ideas for what to do tomorrow, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go right back up to the top of that mountain there, and photograph sunrise in the morning, maybe get up at 4.30, 5 o'clock, and head up that way. I think if if um, the sun is able to rise um, unobstructed, I think it could be a pretty amazing shot. I found some nice compositions and uh, just looking down that valley with the, the cliffs kind of curving, it's just, it's so, it's so amazing. And I, I suppose I could fly the drone up there, but it's supposed to be like 40 knots, blowing 40 knots tomorrow, so. Yeah, it's not going to work too well, <laughs> but <laughs> wait for that car to go. Other than that, uh, I think for the rest of the day, I'm going to head into town, get my battery charged up so my fridge doesn't get too hot, get the drone batteries charged up, and probably get uh, working on editing some video just because I'm, I'm getting a little bit behind. And also get cooled off because I am I'm hot.
Well, I made it back up on the mountain about 30 minutes ago. I got up here around 5.30 and I started around 4.50, so it only took about 40 minutes, which is super quick. But it's currently six o'clock right now. I just got done taking a couple of photographs of the starlight because um, right now we have some really cool cloud uh, formations that are like sprawling towards the camera from the horizon. Um, and it, it creates these amazing leading lines. And so I wanted to capture that just in case that wasn't around during sunrise. But right now it's, I'm a little bit iffy whether or not it's gonna work just because there is quite a bit of cloud along that horizon. Although it does look like after I took the long exposure of the stars, you know, getting it a little brighter so I could see it, it does look like there is this tiniest of gap along the horizon. And so it is a potential that those clouds could light up and create some beautiful, uh, beautiful light and reflected light. So I'm, that's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> anyway, it's still windy out. So I've come back in the saddle that I was at yesterday just to try to avoid it. So you guys can hear me, but just been enjoying it. Um, when I first got up here, the Milky Way was actually pretty visible, which was kind of cool. Just enjoyed that, looking at that for a little bit. Now it's starting to brighten up. But anyway, I'm gonna continue waiting and see what happens. I'll let you guys know if there's anything cool that happens.